Well, tonight, a couple making their mark on the community, mowing dozens of overgrown and abandoned lots for free, is now asking for the public's help. 11 Live's Brittany Kleinbeater first introduced us to Jarvis Drake and Diamond Owens last summer. So tonight, she shares the uphill battle they're facing now that someone stole all of their equipment. Taken from their own turf. Immediately, like my heart dropped. Thousands of dollars in lawn care equipment vanishing last week. We worked so hard, you know, and people People don't know that. They don't see the work that we do behind the scenes on top of the community service. As Drake said, that was new equipment. It took a lot of investing, a lot of hours, a lot of stress, and it's just heartbreaking. Welcome back, babe. I'm not sure if any of you guys are aware yet, but Drake and I are the victims of a theft. Somebody actually stole our entire trailer with all of our lawn care equipment on it from our apartment complex parking deck. Saying that we were heartbroken is to say the least. Drake has already posted a video on his channel where he details everything. So if you haven't seen it already, head over to Drake Lawn Care and check that video out. Today, we're actually trying to upgrade to get a bigger size storage unit. I would like to start by saying thank you to everybody who has supported us, who's sent us words of encouragement, who's donated to our GoFundMe, who's shared the word. And also, we'd like to give a big, wonderful shout out to our friend over at 11 Alive News, Brittany Klein-Peter, for always having our backs and making sure that we're good. Let's go look at a new storage unit. Guys, good news. They do have a 10 by 25 storage unit available. So we actually did go and check out the storage unit. As soon as we make it back over, we'll be able to show you guys us move in. You know how we do, we like to eat, we have to take a break. We've been up since early this morning. We, oh my take gosh, look out. at that catfish. Oh my Look gosh. It's so fresh and crispy. Ooh, we this gonna put me in a good spirit, y'all. Today is a cheat day for us. We've it been is. running three miles a day, getting ourselves in shape for the season. We've cut back on eating out. We've really been eating smoothies at home. And seafood. Seafood only, making salads at home, lots of raw vegetables and things. And we really had to stop and get a quick bite to eat because we got to move all our stuff out to the other storage. Bye and today. So Guys, we are back, and as you can see, this is what our storage unit looks like right now. You see we're missing a whole bunch of equipment. Now what we're doing is getting all of this stuff out, loading it onto the bed of the pickup truck, and then we're gonna move it over into our bigger storage unit. And I think you guys are gonna really like that one because it looks very professional, very durable, and it's bigger, so we'll have more space to do everything. Going through this tragedy really made Drake and I realize how blessed we are. Just seeing the outpour of love and support that we received from our community really just solidified it and showed us just how special of a community we are a part of and how happy we are to be doing what we love. It's kind of funny because Drake and I actually had a vision board written down for ourselves last season. On our vision board was a larger storage unit. We had no idea that losing all of our equipment, everything that we worked hard for, would put us in a position to get a bigger storage unit. God is so good. Dun, 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 dun. This is our new storage unit. Woo we are so excited. It's bigger, it's taller, it's roomier. Drake is in there looking like a small man in this big room. How do you feel, babe? good this is way better we're gonna go ahead and unload and move in i just wanted to touch on a few things as we move in initially our apartment gave us a lot of pushback regarding releasing the video footage from the incident that night now since our news article has aired our apartment complex management has reached out to us however they still have not released the video footage we are actively fighting and working with the apd to figure out who did this to us but enough of that for now. I'm not gonna talk anymore throughout this video. I hope you guys enjoy. If you have any questions at all, please link them in the comments below and I'll be sure to answer them.
taking a break right here to watch Drake do his interview. This is where the wonderful Candace McCohen pulled up on us from WSB TV, uh, Channel 2 News in Atlanta. She wanted to highlight our story and talk to Drake, and she actually featured us on her new segment for the day. What we're left with is not that much. A lot of this was donated to us previously from people that we've helped out. But like I told you guys, we've received a lot of support, a lot of donations. So tomorrow morning, we will be going to go get our brand new trailer and moving it in here. And then hopefully very soon this week, we'll be able to get our new mower and we'll Super. keep you guys updated with us. You got anything to add, babe? Uh, just one thing, man. For all the contractors, landscape out there like us, protect your equipment, make sure y'all get y'all trackers, make sure y'all have y'all business insurance, everything that I'm going through right now, let this be a learning lesson for y'all and I hope that y'all never had to experience this and if you did, I'm sorry to hear that and I hope that you made it through as well. It's just a minor setback, but thanks to all of you, we're going to continue our work that we do. We appreciate you all for supporting us, everybody from rocking with us. If you're not already, please make sure to follow me on Instagram at The Lawn Day. Make sure you're following Drake at Drake Lawn Care. Also subscribe to Drake Lawn Care on YouTube because that's where you see our community service in action. As always, thank you so much. If you're not subscribed to me, but you enjoyed this video and you'd like to see more content from us, please do go ahead and hit that subscribe button as well as that notification bell. We've got a lot of things coming up this season. We're not gonna let this stop us and we want you guys here with us for the journey. Peace. See you next time. <laughs>